Well, all right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my son's world of tanks, Xbox 360 replays. We're in the E75. Yes, I've finally gotten past the Tiger II and onto the E75, so I'm slowly getting up to that 100. Uh, it's been a grind, but it has been a fairly decent grind. It hasn't been horrible. Um, and I haven't played it constantly. I, I jump back and forth. I have so many tanks. I, I never select just one and play it constantly. Um, we're in a tier 10 match, a lot of tier 10s, well, not a lot, but enough. And, uh, this is going to be, um, one of my fail team videos, um, spoiler alert. However, this fail team video happens to be the red team. <laughs> so it's a little twist on the fail team series. Usually I put a video up where my team is just absolute noobs and I do really good and, and it's not the type of video where, um, I... I don't want to brag or anything else, but I just have a you know a decent game. I have an average to decent game, but the rest of my team just completely sucks. That's usually my fail team videos. I haven't done a lot of them. I've only done a few, but um I have a few sitting in the archives that I should comment on and, and do some work, but I haven't got to it yet. But I figured this time. Oh wait, hold a second. Let's take a auto lock on that AMX, and he's gone. Uh, that was awesome. Anyways, back to what I was saying, um, I usually do fail team where my team is just horrible and, you know, I do good and whatever. This is a little twist. Um, this, if you look at the red team, uh, I think maybe two of them at all pulled up to the top. And I was on mic here in a minute and I'm saying, are you serious? Only two tanks come up? But you see them two tanks at uh, BC5 right now, B5C5. I'm pretty sure that and the one we just killed are the only ones that came up at all. Now I know this is an encounter battle, and I know capture the flag is the option, I get it, but if you don't stop the enemy team, which is us, at the, in this game, from pushing around the map like this, you're going to lose. You're going to get raped, your team's going to get obl obliterated, and that's that. And so I thought, well, you know, once in a while I get these videos where I'm on the good team and the other team fails. I figured, yeah, I'll change it up a little bit and put this one up. Now, I'm still expecting something to come up. So I go down low here because I don't want to get something right in the side or in the ass. And I wasted a little bit of time. <laughs> so I don't have a very good game. I haven't had really not a good game at all. But the point of this wasn't to highlight my gameplay or anything else. It's to highlight... For so many people out there um, that don't know how to play this game, do not do what the red team just did in this game. The ones on uh, B4, C4 that just got killed, they didn't even come up the hill at all. None of their team, except for I think two or maybe three tanks, came up here at all. And look what happened to them. They're all down on that bottom line down there. They all stayed down to Death Valley. And they just get oblit obliterated. They just get wiped out. So, again, this isn't to highlight my gameplay or anything else. It's just that some people that are new at the game don't know how to play the game. And they need to learn. Right there, sucked. <laughs> Tell me, I, I mean, I know the shot went a little bit low, but come on now. But, yeah, on every map, and I don't think there's any maps out there, we're going to sink one through that T-57. I don't think there's any maps out there that you can say, no, if you all go this way, you're going to win. Because once you get surrounded, it's just, it's a free-for-all. These people down there cannot have their guns turned, firing at the ones in front of them, and the ones beside them, and the ones almost behind them. It just, and it separates their, their firepower so much that there's nothing they can do. I mean, look how quick this game went. We lost two tanks. About well, three right there. And again, I didn't do very good whatsoever. But the people on that red team, look look at the greens. Look at us. And it's kind of hilarious. But, you know, if, if you are new to the game and you, uh, you don't know how to play certain maps, a good rule of thumb to follow is don't all go one way. You gotta spread out just a little bit. You gotta cover your flank. Because if you don't cover your flank, we pull out the KY and we rape you. So, just a thought. Um, like I said, just a fairly quick video. Nothing special, nothing elaborate. 
I end up with 44,000 silver, 700, 44,700 silver. I don't know how. <laughs> uh, 2,800 XP with a multiplier. Um, did a bit of damage to the E75. You know, we only end up with, what, 2,000 damage, 1,000 spotting. Nothing great whatsoever. Way down at the bottom of my team. But the other team did so bad, I had to put this video up under the fail team series. You know, um, I hope it helps people out. Like I said, um, I shot five shots, penetrated five shots, hit five shots. I was, it, it, I mean, in itself, it was a good game, but it wasn't. I mean, our whole team did awesome, so. But that's because the red team did so bad, so. Um, to any of my subscribers that have been around a while, I apologize. I have a cold. I know I probably sound a little bit different. Maybe I sound better. Let me know. Um, and, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed it. A uh, little, little spin on the fail team series and uh, maybe we'll do a few more of these sometimes because i have a few of these too so hope you enjoyed it as usual comment rate subscribe give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down or give me two thumbs up eh, you probably can't do that In, eh, whatever and uh remember when you're on that battlefield don't all lemming train one way don't be that person cover the flanks the center the sides and and get the job done everyone run into one spot doesn't usually work so yeah remember when you're on the battlefield shoot the red ones <laughs>